Mesa TV presents in three, two, one. Dateline Schools with your host, Terry Harrington. All this weekend, Dateline Schools had the privilege of visiting Gardens Elementary School in Marysville and learning about the elementary Spanish program that they started this school year. And to tell us all about it, my special guest, curriculum director Tracy Eschenberg and Spanish teacher Sherry Faulkner. And, and Sherry, is this program strictly focused on, uh, you know, the grammatics of Spanish and that type of thing, or do you get kind of into the culture and, and what the Spanish way of life is a little bit too? No, actually, um, it's really difficult to learn a language without learning the culture as well. So the program itself is focused on um, all aspects of uh, the Spanish-speaking world. Uh, we do a lot of projects that incorporate culture, and even when we're doing vocabulary lessons, uh, we still have visuals that encompass um, visuals that uh, represent the countries, the people, so they get an idea of how they are, again, similar or different from them. How do the kids respond to that, you know, kind of learning that, you know, we're all a lot similar, but yet we have our differences? I, in the very beginning, the students wanted to know why they were doing what they were doing. And once you pique their interest and they realize that it is important to them, um, and then you hook them with all of their senses, uh, meaning uh, food, visuals, uh, music, movement, uh, and technology, they're all in. Mm -hmm. Tracy, how often do the kids get the opportunity to take Spanish during the day? Is it like one hour a week, or how, how do you guys set that up? Our elementary specials, as we call them, have a rotation. So it's 45 minutes um, once a week for Spanish. And then a little bit extra, we have, a, we have four different specials. So Fridays, we rotate. So they might get it twice, once every four weeks. Now, is that all K-5 mm -hmm. students, or is it at a specific grade level? Yep, all K-5 students receive the equal amount of Spanish each week. Uh, and, and you have three elementary schools mm -hmm. here in the district. The same schedule applies to all three schools? Yes, it's equal for all the students in the district. So how many Spanish teachers do you have then? We have two full-time Spanish teachers, uh, one that is at Gardens, Mrs. Falconer, and then at Washington we have Mrs. Nowakowski, and then Morton, they share that school, or they, they both go there. We'll be back with more tomorrow. For Dayline Schools, I'm Terry Harrington.